Hey guys, it's Taylor here from 1IMS. Today we're gonna to talk about on-page optimization and off-page optimization. When it comes to optimizing your website for Google, it's important to understand what Google looks at when determining where certain websites are gonna show up in search results. Now Google looks at hundreds of different data points and variables when determining what the search engine results are going to be, uh, but they really all boil down into two main categories. There's the on-page optimization or what's on your website, and then there's the off-page optimization or what's on other people's websites. So let's start with on-page optimization. On-page optimization is the, your website in its entirety. So that is the actual code of the website, the structure, the framework, as well as the actual content and how that content is optimized. So typically when we're talking about on-page optimization, we're actually talking about the pages and the content on your website, things like your title tags, your meta descriptions, uh, your internal linking structure, your heading structure, uh, anything that has to do with how the content is structured and read by Google or by other search engines. The off-page optimization is commonly known as the overall backlink profile. So these are other websites that are actually linking to you, linking to your website as a point of reference to show to Google and to the user that uh, your website is relevant and credible because other people are willing to link to you as a point of reference. So in order to have a proper SEO strategy, an SEO strategy that's going to drive uh, quality and relevant traffic, you need to make sure that you have really established uh, both your on-page optimization factors as well as your off-page optimization factors, uh, and that you're doing both of them on a consistent basis to show Google that uh, you're creating fresh, relevant content as well as content that other people are willing to link to.